Hey, what is up guys? FZM here. I've got the Samsung Galaxy Note 8 ready for its second matchup. Let's put it to work. It's time for a speed test between the Samsung Galaxy Note 8 versus the original OnePlus 5. This is the top of the line variant with 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigs of inbuilt storage. It's dominated many speed tests so far. So how's it going to fare up against the Note 8? Let's get straight to business and find out. Time to begin. I'm going to boot up both devices at the same time. Let's check it out. Ooh, very little between them in the opening round, but the Note 8 was the first to launch the homepage in under a second faster than the OnePlus 5. Nice. Next up, let's check out the speed of the apps. Let's go. So there's nothing running in the background. So let's kick things off with the first app. Let's go into the Play Store. Faster on the OnePlus 5. Next up, YouTube. Ooh, a little bit quicker on the Note 8. Unlucky Neo. Don't think you are. No, you are. Instagram. Exactly the same, and the reload was a little bit quicker, I think, on the Note 8. Nice. Chrome. Faster on the OnePlus 5. Okay, moving on, let's go into camera app. About the same, maybe the OnePlus 5 just nicked it. Okay, let's go into the first game, let's go into Temple Run 2. And we've got very fast loading times on the OnePlus 5, wow, okay, that was really quick. I mean, look, you can see the difference already. And the OnePlus 5 is good to go. Let's just get the game running and we'll come back to it. Okay, Subway Surf. Again, really fast times. No messing about with the OnePlus 5. And this isn't the OnePlus 5T, by the way. So, Angry Birds 2. Once again... Loading times are a bit quicker for the OnePlus 5. Already started the game and that is very quick. I'm just going to get the game warmed up a little bit and we'll come back to it later on. Okay, back to the home screen. Let's continue and we'll move into the next app which is Mario Run. Again, loading times coming in quicker for the OnePlus 5 and yeah. It is quicker. Let's go to the next app. Let's go into Boomerang. Take a quick pick. About the same. A little bit quicker reactions, however, on the Note 8. And we'll go into Speed Test. Let's find a server. About the same. Only milliseconds between them. And we'll go into 8 Ball Pool. Ooh, and I'll just give that to the Note 8, fractions of a second between them. Asphalt 8, let's check this one out. So, about the same, but the Note 8 takes that one. Okay. Let's continue on. Let's go back to the home screen. And we'll move on to Android Pay. Faster on the OnePlus 5. Next up we're going to Shazam, about the same, Note 8 probably just nicked it. Play movies, was faster on the OnePlus 5, very fast on both phones. Right, the next round is the multitasking or the RAM management between both devices. I'm going to see how well the apps have been held on memory, so let's scroll back up and I'll go into one of the games that we launched, so Asphalt 8. And as you guys can see, it's held on memory, so we've got 6 gigs of RAM on the Note 8 and 8 gigs of RAM on the OnePlus 5. So Play Store, held on memory. Let's go into speed test, that's held as well. Chrome, perfect, so I'll whisk through them. Instagram, held, and we'll go to YouTube, that's there as well. Snapchat, perfect. All right, let's go into Mario Run, ready to play. Subway Surf, ready to resume. Let's quickly go back off the screen, and Netflix, that's held as well. Shazam, perfect. Next up is Mixer, that's good to go. Next up is 8 Ball Pool, ready to play. And 
Google Play Movies. So you may have noticed I missed a few apps on the RAM management test. For some reason, guys, I don't know where the clips went on my actual recording. However, needless to say, both the OnePlus 5 and Note 8, as I recall, held every single app on memory. So it was a flawless run on both devices, which is fantastic. Okay, next up, the fingerprint sensors. So the fingerprint speed test in three, two, one, go. And one more time. Nice. I'll do a final reboot test, let's see which is the fastest on a full cycle. And 3, 2, 1, go! So let me hear your thoughts on this matchup. Team No 8 versus Team OnePlus 5. Samsung versus OnePlus. I can't wait to see what OnePlus delivers this year. This model right here is phenomenal and it's not even the 5T, yet it's still an absolute animal. I'll be covering charging and battery drain tests with the OnePlus 5 very soon and other types of performance comparisons in the nearby future. As for King Samsung itself, the Note 8, I've got more speed tests around the corner, so stick around. And keep your suggestions coming. I'll be uploading much more frequently nowadays, so expect to see new content on a regular basis from yours truly. So stay tuned because you don't want to miss it. Smash that thumbs up button if you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel and as always guys hit the bell icon so you never miss an upload and I'll catch you guys all on the next one.